It's hard to feel bright and focused and energetic if you spend half the night awake. If you aren't recharging at night, it's also hard to be at your best for all the parts of your life. This episode is about ways to help you sleep better, which means you can be at your best for all the different things you do in your day. So let's have a little look at the cycle of the day. Basically, if you think of this as your day, a lot of people start off tired and then have this series of fluctuations during the day. You start off tired, you go and get a little coffee. You get a little flat spot at 10 o'clock, you have a muffin. You get to lunchtime, food and maybe another coffee. Mid-afternoon, maybe a coffee, maybe something sweet. Trouble is, by the time you get to this part in your day where you're trying to wind down, what happens is that you're so full of coffee and sugar that you end up having a little glass of wine or maybe a couple of beers in order to wind yourself down. Then when you get to this stage in your day where you should be going into rest and digest, which is the time where you need to rejuvenate all your cells, you actually find that because your body isn't tired but your mind is still buzzing, instead of going into that lovely deep sleep, we tend to go into this period of wakefulness that I call wake and worry. Getting better sleep and having more energy is about how you use your body all day. So move a bit more, stretch out when you get home and switch everything off half an hour before bed to wind down for a rejuvenating rest so you wake up with a clearer head and a positive mind.